Hey Mounties, it's Lewis and welcome back to Northwest Sports Network. We have some updates on our new tennis courts. The initial fence post has just been placed. Our tennis courts are finally coming into existence. Now let's send it down to Xander who's going to be talking with our new men's volleyball head coach. Thank you guys. I'm here with Ms. Hoffbauer, the new men's volleyball coach. Can you explain what the men's volleyball team is? I'd love to. Um, so Northwest started a club volleyball team this year and it was very much spearheaded by Jaden Hoffbauer and Caleb Merton and Marcus Arboy and they went to Mr. Stikatowicz to start a club because it is not part of the MHSAA sanctioned sports. Um, be, we committed to this and we are now part of the Michigan Boys Volleyball Conference. This started in 2018 over near Grand Rapids with four teams and now is at to 29 registered teams this year. In order to become um, a sanctioned sport, we need to have 64 men's volleyball teams in Michigan. Now, what are you looking forward to this season? Well, the team and I are really looking forward to learning the sport, okay? Uh, not like backyard rules and not like uh, powder puff volleyball, but really learning how to play the sport and uh, proper skill set. We're also looking forward to having some fun, hopefully winning some games. Um, I think that the group that's there right now really is kind of excited about being the founding members of, of a sports team at Northwest High School. And I think above all else, just personal growth, personal growth in, in the people we're becoming. And if somebody wants to join, like how would they do that? Well, we've been practicing for a couple weeks now, so you'd be a little bit late to the party. Um, but if you're like, whoa, wait a second, this is the first time I'm hearing about this, uh, you should come see me in room 503 and get the packets of information and things like that, and then plan to attend a practice. And once again, this is Ms. Hoffbauer, the men's volleyball coach. Hey, buddies, I'm Dylan. And I'm Carson. And today we're joined by varsity head football coach, Stafford Newsom. Let's get to know our new coach. So what motivated you to become the new varsity coach? Um, I just love the game of football, to be honest. Uh, I think as a head coach and as a coach in general, it's more about uh, the relationships you build with your teammates or your, your players and teammates and your coaching staff and more of having a family atmosphere. Uh, and for a lot of our kids, you know, it's their second family. And for some of our kids, it's really their first family. So I think that's really important to really push that and give them that atmosphere for some of their welcome be at all times. So could you tell us about any uh, football coaching experience you may have? So I've coached at Northwest for five years. During those five years I was an assistant varsity coach. A couple years I was a JV guy. Um, I also coached two years of JV basketball here. That was, that was a fun time and a blast. Uh, I would still be coaching basketball right now if we didn't have five kids, but obviously um, I cut some to your free time, which is a great thing. And, uh, after being here for five years coaching football with Napoleon, we coached football there for three years. So, what will you be wearing for your first game day fit? Uh, a lot of red and black for sure. Uh, we'll be at Eaton Rapids, uh, but we will definitely be repping the Mountie uh, red and black. Um, I'm a pretty uh, non flashy guy, and I kind of like to go under the radar, so to speak, so I'm not going to be. Uh, you know, front and center on a lot of things when it comes to clothing. That's just not who I am. But something simple, red and black, though, for sure. Yeah, for sure. So, as coach, what are you looking forward to for this? Uh, I'm just looking for you know a fresh start uh, for myself and for a lot of guys. We had a meeting the other day. We had 60 guys show up, returning or possibly returning players, uh, which was great numbers because I'm not including the eighth grade uh, coming up to that meeting. Um, I'm just looking for you know, like I said, a new beginning for myself and the guys and. I want our guys to respect each other in the game of football. Uh, it's the best team sport in the world. So I guess that would be what I'm looking for the most. Thanks, Coach Houston. We hope to see you on the sideline this year. I look forward to it. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Our varsity girls basketball team got a big one on Friday night at Penfield with a score of 60 to 38. But our boys lost a close one here in front of the home crowd at Northwest High School. Both our varsity bowling teams took big wins against Penfield, varsity boys 28 to 2, and varsity girls 20 to 10. Make sure you guys come out to Western High School tonight to come watch our basketball teams. Our JV girls play at 4 o'clock, our varsity girls play at 6 o'clock, and our varsity boys play at 7.30. That's all for this episode. Be sure to check in each week for more Northwest Sports Network.